Ah! Und weiter. <lacht> No film, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, looks all right. So hi everyone, Sam here. Welcome back to another video. I just want to give you a little heads up because this video started as a little vlog of me and my friend uh, Maya going out to take photos. And then I kind of turned it into a lens review of first impression. Because I was trying out the new lens, this one here. It's the Leica 50mm Summerit 2.5. And I actually really started to love shooting on a 50mm lens. And this started with the TT Artisan 50mm 1.4 review I did. That reminds me, I still need to announce the winner of the giveaway. At the end of this video, I'm going to announce it. So yeah, this video will be just a fun casual vlog of me hanging out with a friend, taking pictures. You will see some uh, sample photos of this lens and also some film shots from Maya. And uh, it's the first time for her to be on my channel. And we actually shot another video a few weeks later. So yeah, it was fun. I hope you'll enjoy it. And I see you at the end for the giveaway. <laughs> nice house. Yes. Wow. <laughs> okay, so hey, what's up? Sam here, another video. So the city is under lockdown, so there are no people in the city. And we decided, let's go and visit dead people. Not disrespectful at all. <laughs> um, so I'm here with my friend Maya. I'm not dead. She's not dead. <laughs> so this place here is, um, I think it's Europe, uh, Europe's biggest graveyard. I could be wrong, but it's pretty huge. And I've been here before in autumn season. It looks beautiful and we hope for like a lot of snow. But it, there's some cool architecture here and some historical people. We could make some snowmen here. Oh yeah. <laughs> this, is, oh, this looks kind of nice. Yeah. We found art, people. We found art. <laughs> Do this quickly because it's raining and I don't want my camera to get wet. So um, I'm using, uh, as always nowadays, my Leica M262, and I'm actually trying out a new lens. This is the um, 50 Summerit 2.5, and I actually really came to love 50 millimeter. And uh, maybe you already seen my uh, TT Artisan 50 millimeter 1.4 review, and that's where I decided to shoot 50 more. So I really like this uh, lens because it's so small and uh, it's fast enough 2.5 and i don't know how these photos turn out hopefully they are sharp and uh, so far i don't know i think i got some decent pictures but i'm seeing a much more exciting uh, location here so let's go and shoot <laughs> auf diese Kamera, wenn man das <lacht> Handy hat. <lacht> ah, Portra? Portra. The Helvetica of all films. 
Scheiße. Und meine Hand ist so cool. This, this always happens when I film people loading film. So why, why do you shoot film? Why go through this? Because it's so complicated and, <laughs> and, and complex and too much work. I like challenges, you know? Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and expensive. I like expensive stuff. Tell me a little bit about your equipment. So what, what's your camera and why you're using it? How much is it? Where can I find it? Links down below. <laughs> this is, of course, very unique. You can't find it, no, just, <laughs> just, just kidding. I'm having Mamiya 645, yeah. the super version. I like it because it's sleek, I like the design. Mm. I have the 45mm um, lens. Yeah. And the thing is, you can yeah. compartmentalize, you can just yeah. like take everything off and uh, you can switch it off, for example, if you want to... If you have a film inside and you're in the middle of the shooting mm. and you want to change into another film, what you can do is you can just switch the back end, mm. um, just take this off yeah. and switch it with another back end with another film and uh, you can shoot a different frame with, uh, with this. And also you can take this off mm. and put a, a, how do you call it? another viewfinder from the top mm -hmm. and also it's because Willem Fabik uh, used this camera Ah, uh, okay <laughs> shout out shout out <laughs> so just to talk a little bit about this lens, uh, I actually got this for like 400 euro. Um, not because it's that cheap, but this usually goes for like a thousand bucks on eBay. And I sold my TT Artisan lens um, for like 600 uh, euros. So I was able to buy this for 400 and it's actually very good. They don't, Leica doesn't make this lens anymore. They have this new version uh, 2.4, uh, which is also nice but uh, most people they want you know the Summicron or Summilux and I think this is actually a very good option it's tiny it's sharp um, it's super smooth like the focus ring it's a little loose but I actually like that and yeah looks good it's nice must be nice <laughs> okay we are at the end uh, we are tired it's super cold we want to go home and um, yeah, I hope this was interesting. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. It's. I think I'm going to make this a lens review video, maybe. <laughs> Just to get more clicks. Um, no, but this is the first time of me using this lens and I'm pretty sure the photos will be okay. Nothing special, but at the moment you can't really do any street photography and I actually really enjoy doing walks and like parks and and, and it's also very challenging to uh, take pictures in the cold mm -hmm. because you don't really... Uh, I can't really feel my fingers right now. <laughs> We've been out here for, I don't know, four hours at least. At least, yeah. And it's, it's always snow constantly snowing, so my camera's wet. I definitely want to do this again with better light. Yes. So I think you will see... Uh, de we'll definitely see uh, more of us doing these photo walks. I'm sure we will do uh, another one soon and anything you want to plug? Do you want people to go to your Instagram because you were very private for a while? Yeah, that's true. Yeah? Uh, yeah. Anyways, you can check her out here to see more photos and um, let's go and go back into the graves where we belong. <laughs> All right, so I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Um, it was fun and I really enjoyed shooting on the 50 Summerat 2.5 until the XE4 came out. <laughs> now this will be a topic for another video, but uh, I'm currently shooting uh, this video on the XE4. I have a bunch of videos of the XE4 coming out, little vlogs and photo walks. Um, anyways, this lens is great, a great option for anyone shooting on a Leica. Um, it's super sharp. It has this modern look. Um, the bokeh looks nice. 
And the size is what really sold me um, because this isn't much bigger than my 28 Elmerit. This is how a lens should be on a Leica and not, you know, like this. But enough Leica talk, let's reveal the winner of the TT Artisan 50mm 1.4 lens. So I actually didn't pick the winner, but my wife did. And I gave her my phone and said, you know, just pick a random winner, some comment with the number 7. So number 7 was correct. Um, and that's what she did. Yeah? This guy. Okay. And we have a winner, congratulations, CRTDT. Uh, he comment or she, uh, seven lenses, nice music choice, and seven was correct. Again, congratulations, this is yours now. I hope you enjoy this. Um, it's a great lens and I really enjoyed my time with it. Sorry for everyone who didn't win, but there can only be one winner, of course. Um, but I really appreciate your participation. Participation? participating. I appreciate you participating. I hope it was at least fun searching for all the lenses. Uh, I know that I had fun editing this video. So yeah, I appreciate every one of you and I see you in the next video, hopefully very soon. I don't have internet at the moment. And the fact that you're watching this video right now uh, means I probably camped at some Apple store in the city. I did it for you. <laughs> okay, see you next time. Thanks for watching. I'm out.